Hey there, tennis fans! Have you ever wondered who was the best teenage sensation in the world of tennis? Today on Tennis Tenacity, we're diving deep into the world of teenage tennis prodigies. In this electrifying episode, we'll reveal the top 10 youthful tennis talents of all time. From fearless phenoms to court conquerors, these young athletes have left their mark on the world of tennis. And we're about to unveil their incredible stories. So without further ado, let's jump right into it, starting with number 10. Kicking off our list at number 10 is the sensational Coco Gauff, the young American dynamo who burst onto the scene with a bang at the age of 14. Coco was just 18 years old when she took the tennis world by storm, reaching the French Open final in 2022. She lost to Iga Schwontek, but the world was getting a glimpse of what she could become. In the highly anticipated 2023 US Open final, Coco Goff showcased her remarkable skills and unwavering determination. By beating the formidable Arena Sabalenka in three sets in a battle that had tennis fans on the edge of their seats, Goff's performance left an indelible mark, reaffirming her status as one of the most promising talents in the tennis world. Coco Goff is a name that will echo through tennis history for generations to come. Coming in at number 9 is the legendary Michael Chang, a true pioneer of teenage tennis success. On June 11, 1989, Chang beat Stefan Edberg to become the youngest ever French Open champion at 17 years old. Chang was down two sets to one, but rallied to impress the Paris crowd with a gritty five-set victory. Earlier in the 1989 French Open, Chang had a memorable moment as the first underhand serve in tennis history, but it was an act of desperation, not strategy. He was facing the number one seed, Yvonne Lendl, in the fourth round and had rallied from a two-set deficit, but he was cramping badly in both legs into the fifth set. Chang managed to battle through those cramps to eventually beat the number one seed, Lendl, in that epic fifth set. At number eight, Jennifer Capriotti turned professional at the age of 13 years, 11 months, losing in a tournament at that age in Boca Raton, Florida, to Gabriella Sabantini. Capriotti went on to the semifinals of the 1990 French Open at the age of 14, and in October 1990, became the youngest player ever to be ranked in the top 10. Jennifer Capriotti's decision to turn pro at a young age came with immense pressure and expectations. Her struggles with the demanding professional circuit, coupled with personal challenges, painted a vivid picture on the toll that early fame and success can take on a young athlete. Sliding into number seven is the enigmatic Bjorn Borg, the sweetest sensation who took the tennis world by storm in the 70s. Borg was only 18 when he secured his first Grand Slam title at the French Open in 1974. Known for his ice-cool demeanor and devastating topspin, he became a true icon of the sport. However, burnout from the constant pressure to win led to his early retirement at the young age of just 26 years old. At number 6, 19-year-old Carlos Alcaraz claimed his maiden Grand Slam title at the US Open in 2022 and became the youngest man to ascend to world number one. The 19-year-old dragged his weary body to a 6-4, 2-6, 7-6, 6-3 victory over Norway's Kasper Ruud in the final. Alcaraz defeated seven-time champion Novak Djokovic in a five-set epic to claim his first Wimbledon title and second Grand Slam in 2023. In the historic match, Alcaraz became the youngest Wimbledon's men champion since Boris Becker in 1985. Carlos Alcaraz is undeniably the future of men's tennis. Thanks to his extraordinary combination of youth, raw talent, and a fearless attitude on the court. His powerful strokes, exceptional court coverage, and composure under pressure not only make him a force to be reckoned with today, but also hint at a future filled with Grand Slam triumphs and a legacy that will inspire generations to come. In the fifth spot, 
we have the German wonderkind, Boris Becker. He made history by winning Wimbledon at just 17 years old in 1985. Becker is the youngest ever winner of the Gentleman Singles Wimbledon Championship title. Taking us to number four is the Swiss sensation, Martina Hingis. At the tender age of 16, Martina became the youngest Grand Slam winner in history when she triumphed at the 1997 Australian Open. Her tactical brilliance and exceptional court awareness set her apart from her peers. During her career, she won a total of 25 Grand Slam tournaments in all three disciplines. She won five singles titles, 13 doubles titles, and seven mixed doubles titles. Landing firmly at number three is the king of clay himself, Rafael Nadal. Rafa was just 19 when he won his first Grand Slam title at the 2005 French Open. His relentless work ethic, fierce determination, and incredible topspin forehand have earned him legions of fans. Slipping into the second spot is the British sensation Emma Raducanu. In 2021, at the age of 18, Emma stunned the world by winning the U.S. Open as a wild card entrant. Her poise, fearless play, and remarkable composure under pressure left everyone in awe. And now, folks, brace yourselves for the number one teenage tennis sensation of all time, the legendary Steffi Graf. Steffi, who turned pro at 13 years old. A 19-year-old Steffi Graf won all four Grand Slams and the Olympic gold medal in the same year. She is the only tennis player to do so still to date. She won 22 Grand Slam titles in a 16-year professional career, the second most behind Serena Williams' 23 since the start of the Open era in 1968, and the third most in history behind Margaret Court, who has 24. Her breathtaking forehand and relentless pursuit of perfection made her a tennis icon. Honorable mention entries are the legendary Serena Williams, who won the 1999 U.S. Open Final just two weeks before her 18th birthday, and Monica Seles, who won two Grand Slam titles before the age of 18. There you have it, tennis enthusiasts, the top 10 best teenage tennis sensations of all time, brought to you by Tennis Tenacity. From Coco Golf to Steffi Graf, their journeys are filled with highs, lows, and unexpected twists that remind us of the incredible resilience and talent of these young athletes.